Hi, so I'm Neil O'Brien, and I'm the Director of Operations here at Chelsea Teddy Bear Company. And that's where we're at. We're at our headquarters here in Chelsea, Michigan. And Chelsea Teddy Bear is, uh, basically what we do is we sell college licensed teddy bears into the college bookstore market, and we sell Navy, U.S. Navy uh, licensed teddy bears into the Navy PX stores. In addition to that, we now sell teddy bears in the promotional marketplace. When people come on the tour, we open up those doors and they all come out, and the tour leader then kind of gives them a rundown of, of the production of how teddy bears are made. And then they talk about the bears that we make here. Here's Connor, that bear. And we show them how each limb and the body all have to be stuffed separately. That the, the legs we've got, you know, each leg is its own piece that's put together, stuffed, sewn closed by hand, and then attached together there. So we show an example of one finished, and then we show how it, how it starts out with the front and the back that the, the buyer gets to choose, and then they choose the face, like here's this face doesn't have the tongue and this one does. So we show them that kind of stuff. And then we also talk about the custom outfits that we do. We got an order this year from State Farm Insurance and they bought uh, 50,000 of this teddy bear for a promotion they're doing with the little chef's hat. The main sewing machine is right over here. That's our industrial sewing machine. We've got a couple others that do some of the detail work. So it's a very sharp die, and it has these uh, uh, foam pieces all the way around, which are called ejectors. Because when you put that onto the plush, and you stamp it, and then you pick it up, it would have all the felt that we cut, or the, or the uh, fleece that we cut, in those spots. So these ejectors then push it back out so it's not stuck into the die, and you don't have to pick it up. You can then just pick the die up and move it over to the next one. And there's the end result of some of those uh, die cuts that have, that have happened with the extra fabric.